Oh, so hello everybody. The family here was able to fix everything. Okay, so uh, the position I want to work today are uh, this one. You see, I'm squatting low, okay? And uh, I'm gonna switch from one side to another, okay? I'm here, okay? And I'm gonna go here, and I stay very low, okay? Here, try to stay as low as you can, you see? I'm going low, low, low as I can. Now, the other step I can do is this one. I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna switch one side, and after I'm gonna step, and I'll switch, switch, step. Try to don't put your hands on the floor. Switch, okay? If you only have a, a little bit of space, you don't need to switch. If you are like me, struggling of, of space still, here, you go here, boom, 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 okay? So let's do it for a minute. Ready? Go! Let's go, let's do it. I'm gonna just, yeah, good. Let's go. Here. Okay, here. Shh. Okay, you need to learn to move your hips like that because this is gonna happen in fight a lot, okay? And after you can use the knee cut here, bam, if you need to, okay? You are here in switch position. Okay? This can happen if you do the uh, the shotgun is uh, pass, okay? We go here. Boom! Okay. So now. So now. Sorry, but today is my first time while I'm alone. So I'm struggling a little bit to find time, but it's fine. So now, what we're gonna do is this. Uh, I'm gonna do this one, okay? I'm here, here, on my back, okay? Foot up, and I'm moving here, 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 okay? Now you put the other foot down, and you move here, okay? So, and you just do that, okay? And this can be, for some people, can be a good uh, abs workout, okay? So ready, go. I hope you're enjoying the teenager music that I put. I didn't very really pay attention to what I was putting. Come on, eight more seconds. Okay. So this is a very good, you can do it with a partner, okay, to uh, make uh, him move right, left, and you just try to uh, control him, okay? Remember, this is a solo class, but if you can cheat, have a partner, or whatever, please do it, okay? Okay? So now, we're gonna talk about one move that we don't do a lot in class and is bad, you should learn that. And my foot too, even in my dojo, I was not teaching that movement too often, but you have to teach it. It's the reverse shrimp. 
So I'm here. And we're gonna do reverse swimming like a deep, uh, like we are doing a deep up guard, okay? So I'm going here, stepping, okay? And bring my body in, you see? I bring my body in, okay? And now I slide inside and I turn, you see? I'm not, I'm using my legs to turn and I turn to the other side here, okay? This is how we do a deep up guard, okay? This is a very basic movement for deep up guard. You are here and you, you are in half guard and you go here, boom, inside, grabbing, boom, you go inside and now you use your legs to turn and to go to the other side, okay? So let's go. you turn here, boom, okay, you go here, here, in, and you turn, here, boom, boom, and you see I don't touch the floor with my legs, I turn like that, boom, okay, and go here, and go here, boom, okay, and if you can turn without using your body, your hands is good, Go here, boom, and I turn here, okay? Boom, and I turn here. I'm using my legs to turn, not my body, not my chest, okay? Here, I turn, boom, boom, boom. And this is how we do a deep up down, okay? Okay? That's important, that this movement. Okay? Sorry, I'm gonna have to change the music. The music made me go nuts. I don't like that music so badly that I'm gonna just put. Uh, sorry. Oh, way better. So. Oh my goodness, publicity. This is the life. This is the problem of life. Life. Okay, so now I want to talk about something that beginner make a lot of mistakes. It's the butterfly, or it's the shin to shin, doesn't matter, okay? Look, this is butterfly, okay? I don't want to see this. This is bad, okay? This is not how you should do. Butterfly is like that. You go, you put your elbow inside, okay? You keep this up. Now, I'm not going back, I'm going to the side here, okay? I'm trying to be as much as a ball as I can, okay? And now, I'm gonna bridge, okay? I'm gonna bridge by using that leg, but this leg doesn't fall down. I'm trying to point the sky with that knee, okay? And I'm bringing my butt as high as I can here, okay? Because my partner is here, and now I'm gonna fall, and I end up on my knee here, and I turn, okay? If I want to do it the advanced way, it's always the same thing, but instead of ending on your knee, you end up by uh, inverting. So you go here, you see, elbow inside, inside, because I'm wrapping the arms. I fall to the side here, okay? Knee pointing up the sky as much as I can, okay? I go here, boom. But now the advanced way, I'm gonna put my head inside and bring my legs in front and turn, okay? But that's it, guys. So don't lean back. So let's go. Okay, after this one, we're gonna do some uh, compound movement, okay? A little bit more complex. So I start here. I go in. Boom. Boom. Boom, boom. Okay, here, inside. Okay, I go here, boom, boom, and here. Sorry, I was confused. I was like, I'm going in there, I'm going not in there, what I'm gonna do? So I'm gonna, now I'm gonna in there, okay? I go here. But inversion is the same thing. I'm going here and I'm using these legs, you see these legs? And now I'm in there. Boom, okay? So I go here, here. 
Put your elbow inside. Go here. Boom. Okay. Here. Here. Okay. Now here. Boom. 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 Okay. So now we're going to do some compound movement. Okay. So we're going to do some movement that are connecting together, okay? So look, I'm on my back, okay? So this is a little bit for advanced, but try to, if, you, if that's your first class or second class, try to figure it out just by challenging yourself that you're improving, okay? So we're going to do this one, okay? An easy one at the beginning, I'm here, okay? Maybe it's in mount, maybe it's in the side control, it doesn't really matter. I'm here, I'm going to bridge, I'm going to turn on my shoulder here, boom, and maybe I got this back, okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the hooks, bam, okay, and now I'm going to sit, okay, look, I'm here, and now I'm going to sit, drop, okay, and go with the other hooks here, boom, no, sorry, Go here, boom, 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 and catch the back. So I show it again. I'm here. Reach. Go here. Bam. Controlling. Putting the first hook. Sitting. Putting. Going down and putting the second hooks. Okay. Okay. So I'm rolling because I don't have a partner. But if you have a partner, don't try to roll to the other side. Okay. Just stay one side is fine. Okay. So let's go. this class I'm going more gentle because we're going to do fitness at the end my wife cannot help me today so we're going to do fitness at the end okay uh, so now uh, what we're going to do is this one this is a move I don't I do it all the time in the shadow jiu jitsu when I said I'm going to be more acrobatic but I never show it so look I'm going to put my head on the floor and I'm going to look the camera, okay? I'm looking one place, I'm looking you Instagram, okay? And my head going to not move, but my legs going to move, okay? So here, and now I'm going here, here, here. When I reach here, I'm inverting, but I'm staying watching the same spot. If your head start to turn, it's not good. Now I walk, 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 and I'm gonna invert here. And going here. Boom. Okay? So this is a very good exercise to keep your balance when the guy tries to sweep you and you need to, you know, jump, recover the position, whatever, okay? It's beautiful, you should learn that. So just do your best, okay? Go and try to keep your legs close to your head. Here. 
<laughs> almost, almost fainted. Okay guys, so that's a very good way to, if someone tries to sweep you and you can end up on your legs and just boom, turn, man, you're going to be a nightmare, you're going to be a nightmare to sweep, man, I tr trust me. So now, now, we're going to do some stuff that are not, they are not movement that you really do in the, in the fight or maybe, man. But they are more position that you end up in movement that you do it, not in this order, but you still do it. So we're gonna start in the S position. So S position, I'm here. I don't put my foot below my knee. I keep it here in front, okay? So now look, I'm gonna invest. I'm gonna put my hands behind my back and connect my shoulder here. This is a complex movement, okay? So try to do your best. Now I'm gonna go with my legs here. Boom, boom. When I'm here, I'm gonna drop the other side, okay? And I'm gonna kick my legs here. Belly down here, kicking to the other side. And I end up in S position. And I go to the other side here. And when I'm here, I'm kicking my legs here. Boom, boom, boom. I keep my legs up, 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 up. Turn, here, here, here. Okay? This is body coordination, guys. I know it's difficult, but you need to learn body coordination because Jiu Jitsu is only about how can you combine movement together. Last time there was a question about action reaction. Action reaction is about combining movement together, combining faster than your opponent. Okay, if your opponent take uh, one fraction of a second more every time, you're gonna beat him. If you take more than uh, than him time to combine movement, he gonna beat you. So it's about combining movement. So you need to be able to combine and connect movement together on your own. Okay. So. After a lot of chit chat, let's start it. Go. Goes. Go. So I'm here. Okay. Uh, let's go here. And I'm going here. Boom. Boom. Inverting. Going here. Bam. 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 Just find the flow. You don't need to invent like a crazy, okay? It's about flu fluidity, okay? Okay. So, how to do the Shadow Jiu Jitsu? 
It is your, if it is your first class, you can try to watch me, but I'm gonna do all the movement that I know, okay? And combine it how I want, so it's gonna be difficult. Uh, so just do the movement that you learn and try to combine them, okay? Try to remember the movement that you learn and try to come. If you only remember two movements, combine these two movements. If you have some experience of Jiu Jitsu fight, imagine that you are fighting someone and the position is going to come naturally. And that's it, okay? For the people that are already did three or four videos again, they start to get the hang of it. Just go, flow, roll, okay? Just roll, just do the combination that you want, okay? That you know, that's fine. If you have some gymnastica uh, background, do gymnastica movement. The idea is that you have to combine movement together, okay? So if you have more flexibility and more movement that you know than me, just do the movement that you know, okay? But always with the idea that it's for Jiu Jitsu, it's not dancing. Okay. So five minutes. No, five, not 15 minutes, please. Go! Let's go! Me now, now, sorry. Qu'est-ce que t'as fait, mon amour? Faut pas toucher la lumière. Shh. 
N'en remise-vous pas avec ça, ça c'est pour euh, Tennessee. Reste là où c'est. Second, I started with the second gymnastic and natural. Uh. Okay, let's go. Shh. 
stand up, you need to stand up, technical natural. Uh, technical stand up, technical natural. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. someone do with jiu jitsu with that person okay this is about doing jiu jitsu it's not about doing solo class he's doing solo class if you have nobody okay if you have someone you can still follow the class that we do the 20 minute uh, technique and after the 20 other minute or we doing a rolling you roll with your partner okay so let's go stop talking and now more action boom now I'm gonna be a little bit more acrobatic. Okay? Oh, I'm improving that side. One hands. One hands. I started badly. Oh, almost guy. Oh, I hurt my hips. Oh, that was a free injury. Other side, other side, I'm gonna mess. Okay, now back uh, front flip. Okay, now the thing 
Inhale, we'll just messed up. The drum back and forth. to win medals and to beat people it's, it's a good thing when you are young because that's the mentality I had mentality a lot of people had but it should be it should be uh, when you get older jiu-jitsu should, uh, martial arts should not be a way to beat everybody up it should be a philosophy of life okay you should, I'm not saying that you should give up trying to improve and everything and you should stop fighting. No, still enjoy fighting, still enjoy uh, submitting people, still enjoy having a strong, tough fight. Still enjoy it, but you need to understand that when you reach uh, 34, 35 and you start to have a, a job and everything and uh, responsibility, martial art is a way to stay healthy. And it's a philosophy of life, it's a way of, of living. So you need to uh, uh, understand that some stuff that before you were in your ring, you need to learn them very well. And breaking, break fall, if you are more than, uh, how we said, okay. I'm not a doctor, but if you are older, it's a very important thing because you can avoid to get hurt. Or if you have a car accident, okay? My wife got, got, was in the bike. She got, uh, someone opened the door, she, the bike hit the door, she fly away, she had the helmet, but she, uh, she did a front roll, two to four front roll. If she didn't know front roll, her head would have hit the, 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 the concrete, and I don't know how, where she will be today. And I have a lot of other friends that uh, had a car accident or mo motorbike accident and were able to do front roll, brake fall, and, and reduce the damage that they had. It. So remember, 
not only think about what happens if you fight someone, think about what happens if you fall, okay? So, all these beautiful things, now we're gonna go with the breathing, okay? Uh, so, the breathing is very important, uh, it helps you to uh, survive longer against a tough opponent, so I'm gonna explain you how to breathe. So, you're inhaling with the nose, exhaling with the mouth, okay? You always focus on exhaling. Using, uh, you have to use strength when you're exhaling, not when you're inhaling. So, there's two exercises you can do. You inhaling, exhaling as fast as you can, always focus on the exhaling. When you exhale, try to bring your belly in, try to bring everything in. Uh, the second exercise is you exhaling everything you have, you keep it for as long as you can, your lungs totally empty. Um, you can play with your abs in, uh, in during that time, and when you cannot keep it, uh, you cannot uh, do it anymore, you're inhaling. Uh, I am on that position or see on my knee like that because I wanted to show you the exercise I'm doing but at home you can lay down, stand up, sit, whatever position that makes you comfortable. You can close your eyes, open your eyes, meditate, pr pray, whatever you want. It's not about religion, it's about breathing but you, you do it how you feel better, okay? We're gonna do that for two minutes. Um, let's go. <sighs> A lot of talking. Don't like talking, guys. Trust me. So. Go! So now, uh, because I don't have a partner, we're gonna do fitness, but remember, you should watch technique every day. You should go online and watch some technique in some kind. I watch one hour uh, of technique every day, okay? At home, I sit and I watch people fighting and people should watch. If you find that boring, so don't do one hours, but at least watch one fight and watch one technical video, okay? Something, because you are training your brain, okay? Do you want to be good in jiu-jitsu? Right now it's less fun than usual. Usually we go, we fight, we roll, we have some fun, we, we met people and everything, but you need to ask yourself, if, if jiu-jitsu is a, is a life, is a life, uh, is a life, philosophy of life, you should do jiu-jitsu even if jiu-jitsu is not the most fun, okay? Because the idea is that when you come back, you become you get more stronger, okay? You get better. So that's it. I know this is not my favorite jujitsu, okay? If, if jujitsu will be only that, I will not do jujitsu myself. But for now, jujitsu is that because there is no other way. So bear with me. 
So now we're gonna do some exercise, okay? Fitness. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you can feel the motivation I have too. So, uh, you can do it like that. There's many ways you can do it. If you have a medicine ball, you can grab the medicine ball, okay? Always bring your knee outside, okay? Don't, the problem of squatting very low is that people bring their, their knee inside. This is bad. Bring the knee outside and squat low, okay? When you are here, I want you to come back up and you jump, okay? So here, sh sh okay? This is very good because by keeping like that, you are most, when you take a medicine ball like that, you are muscling your, your chest a little bit and lower, your lower back. And in Jiu-Jitsu, we know that lower back, this is a problem of injury, okay? Because you don't have a strong lower back. So now let's go, let's do it. Let's do it! So we're gonna do it for uh, one minute, okay? And I'm gonna put back the music. Ah, god damn it, sorry, people. Go! Go! So here, if you don't have a medicine ball, you just jump, okay? So now, we're gonna do some push up, okay? So I'm gonna quick move the mat, okay? If you don't have chair, do it on, uh, do it on your, on the floor, okay? But if you have chair, there's a good way to do it. It's like that. You grab the chair, okay? Pam, that was doing that when I was younger. That was the way I was doing push up. Okay? So, if you can have a high, uh, something higher for your feet, better. So, you put your hands here. Okay? You put your feet here. Okay? And now you go as low as you can and as high as you can. And you do as many as you can. Okay? Go! You really go as low as you can. Chair, you can do it with the chair. If you have weight, 
You can do it with the weight on the floor. You can do this if you want. Okay, knee on the, this knee on the floor, totally possible, okay? Good. If you have a chair, let's use the chair. I'm here, okay? And I'm going to put it here. And I'm just going to go as low as I can, okay? And as up as I can, okay? I want to feel the stretch, stretch and up, okay? We add stretching to be able to use strain even if we are, your body is at the full ex extent of the stretching because in Jiu Jitsu, this happens a lot. You are in this position, oh, you need to use this strain even if your hands are far apart, okay? So let's go. We're out of for the duo. Let's go. Just realize that this way is, uh, doesn't work. Muscle the back. Okay, I did another chest and arms thing. Sorry. Next one we're gonna do. We're gonna do back. Everybody. Okay, so just realized I was wrong that sorry. This is a still a, a arms but not back. So what we're gonna do is that we're gonna do with the chair here and you're gonna do this. Okay, so if you don't have weight, you can use a bar. Okay, pull-ups. It's even better. Pull-ups are even better, but I don't have pull-ups here. Okay, whatever you can use to lift you up like that, that movement. It's great, okay? You can have a partner, you can grab your arms and you can just go up, up, okay? But I don't have a partner and I don't have a bar. So I do with what I have. Okay, go. Okay, I'm gonna do 30 seconds one side, 30 seconds the other side. And you pull it, you pull it. Other side. Okay, the lateral halves because I'm not a big believer on, on uh, doing the work of the halves. Okay, of course, yeah. everything you do requires some uh, core strength. So, if you do fitness, your halves are gonna be strong no matter what. Just focus on your just strain your core for every exercise that you're gonna do, and that's it. You don't need to lose, but the thing is, the side halves that you need to muscle them, okay? So how we muscle side abs, okay? So, quick fix, quick fix. Here, so how we muscle side abs. So look, I'm gonna grab anything, anything. Guys, really anything. You can also grab nothing, but it's better to grab something, even a bottle of water. And you go here, sha, sha. Sure. And you keep your legs up, okay? So, we out of for the do, like I, lo I love to say. 
Ready, go! <clears throat> so I'm here. Okay. Oh, oh. Sh 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 if you don't have weight, shut down. Okay? You try to keep your legs to not moving. Stop every day. I'm asking one minute, guy. I'm a very sweet guy. So let's go. Let's go. If you have a little weight, like two pound, three pound, it can hold. You can do it with the weight too. Okay? Let's go! Keep your back straight! You deserve it. Now, I know it was not your usual class, but you know, this is show you that 
Even when you don't have a partner, hey, you can still do something. Even if you don't have mats, still do something. Okay? If Jiu Jitsu is a philosophy of life, right now, it's time to prove it, guys. Prove it. Go ahead, do Jiu Jitsu no matter what. When you're gonna come back doing Jiu Jitsu and you're gonna fight all these people that eat, did nothing during one, two, three months, maybe more, and you're gonna beat the shit out of, the, of them. Oh my God, you're gonna feel like a champion, okay? I'm training, thinking about them, thinking about my sweet partner that did nothing, and that I'm gonna see them when I come back with a smile on my face, ready to rock and roll, baby. Okay, see you everybody. Have a good day. Oh.